Well, sadly, our uh, RV season is coming to an end. So we're in the middle of getting this thing ready to be stored. Uh, we are storing it outside under cover, so one of the things we got to be careful about is make sure mice don't get in. So we're going to mice-proof um, our RV. And the way that I always do it is this stuff works pretty good here. This is called Dreaming Earth Botanics Mouse Away Concentrate. And it's a blend of peppermint and spearmint oil. And basically, um, you get some glass uh, ware, and I just put in, just soak these cotton balls here, like so. And this stuff isn't cheap, it's pretty expensive. It's around $15 for this bottle. Now, this will make your coach think to high heaven, like spearmint in peppermint. But the mice don't like to smell so they stay away. So we don't have to worry about being environmentally irresponsible or anything like that. You know we are protecting the environment I guess. And uh, anyway uh, we soaked uh, those cotton balls and then we're just going to strategically place those around the inside of the coach and uh, that will keep the mice out. Now, yes, it does stink, and it'll, when you come in, the coach will smell like peppermint, but we use a slash gear, and uh, during spring commissioning, after a couple days, airing it out, the smell went away, and we didn't smell it at all during the summer, so, you know, I have no issues in using these. Now, the one thing is, though, you want to use glass. Uh, last year, we tried plastic cups to begin with <laughs> in the... Uh, oil melted right through it so use glass cups or glass jars whatever you want coffee cup whatever so just put these uh cups in strategic locations we usually put one in the front one in the rear one in the uh, kitchen sink and one in the bathroom that should be enough okay we also just use uh fabric softener sheets this bounce and just lay a couple around uh, the other areas like our uh, storage bins and this supposedly keeps mice out as well. Again, I have no proof of this, but we haven't had any mice issues, so I'm gonna I'm gonna say that it works. And so we're just gonna put fabric softener sheets in all the little bins, so that we have all the outside protected as well. This is a power outlet compartment, and this hole through the bottom here is where. Um, where the, let me get the flashlight in here so you can see it, there you go. Um, that's where, uh, this is just a little inspection cover, a little marine type inspection cover that comes off. And then the uh, electrical hose just goes down in there. So what I usually do is take a funnel and set the funnel in there like that. And what we'll do is we'll cut the, uh, extension cord coming up through there and put this funnel around it and then that will help keep mice out of here. Okay this is what we got. I cut the funnel and then uh, put some Gorilla Tape on it and just tape the cord to it and uh, now all we got to do is just feed it in here like so. Okay that's uh, comes through the bottom like that and then we'll just plug it in and then uh, we don't have to worry about mice in the uh, power outlet uh, compartment. Well, not part of uh, mouse proofing, we also put uh, damp red in, keep the humidity down, plus a couple of air fresheners. And we'll just uh, place one in the sink and one in the bathroom and I don't know, we'll find a place for the other one. And then uh, we'll be all ready to button it up um, after this is done.